Hello friends and welcome to my channel if you're new or welcome back if you are back. If you are new, hi, my name is Rabbit and my pronouns are they them and I am super excited but also like a little bit embarrassed for today's video because I did the same thing that I did last year where I wait like a freaking year to unbox viewer mail because like at first I'm like oh I'll wait till I have like a couple of pieces built up so I can do like a proper like length video and then things build up too much and then I get really overwhelmed and then I just like put it off and everything like stays in a corner and I keep being like I need to make a video about this but then I don't do it and then I feel really guilty because like everyone's so sweet and generous to like send me stuff and then I feel like I'm it's like oh gosh but I am here and very excited to unbox some viewer mail today again I am so so sorry that it took so long if you have sent me mail I want to say thank you in advance. Y'all are too sweet to me and um, it's it's just too, too kind. Um, so without further ado, I will try to like link everyone who mentions like shops and um, Instagrams and anything that like are, they are okay with being mentioned below. Um, I will try to timestamp like initials and where the person is from. So like if you have sent me something and you want to see that specific part, you can see that. But without further ado, let's get into it. I'm like so nervous and excited, but I'm going to start with this incredibly adorable letter. Look at this adorable packaging. Love like the little mummy and the little skull. Very very Halloween and precious and it has a very very cute little art by jelly kind of design on the back so that's very exciting I'm assuming that's okay to share because it's probably like a an Etsy store or something but I have blacked out the um the actual address itself but very very cute okay let's give this an open frick you guys this is too good what the f holy oh my god you guys okay this is too much. Oh, okay, there is a note. Okay, here is a- Oh my gosh, there is- Cool, okay, fantastic. There is a coupon code to share with the followers. First I will show you this incredible art, and then I will show you the coupon code because you'll probably want to know it after you see this art. Okay, hello. Look at this patch. Wednesday Adams with the spider webs and like this- What? Like, I wonder what you did this with. Because the gradient is so nice and pretty, but the lines are like still so crisp, and this is so cool. It's like a two-headed, like, possum raccoon hybrid beast creature wearing a dress, like a vintage old style dress, and they're carrying an axe. I didn't even notice that till now. The spider webs in the corners are absolutely incredible. Dude, this is gonna look so cool on my jackets. I'm like, almost, you know when you get like a really cool sticker and you're like, I love it, but I'm like too scared to put it on something because then it'll be like on that thing. But I'm also like not feeling that because I'm like, I'm so excited to show this off. So it's this very like push and pull feeling at the moment. Oh my god, look at the skull. Okay, so it's like this incredible skull, like the candle. And these are, these little star things, those are my favorite kinds of stars. Those are the best. This is so cool. I feel like this is a very like Edgar Allan Poe kind of aesthetic. Oh, and then there's ones on like black fabric. Okay, cool. Let's see this. Dude, these are so good. Spider in like a bubble. I watched The Labyrinth again last night for like the 5,000th time and like every time I see like bubbles or crystal balls or like anything like this I'm just like oh. Very very cool with that. Okay. I need to recreate this dress. This is such a pretty outfit. Hello? The skull is so cool. The little cleaver. Is that what it's called? I think so. Cleaver. Amazing. And then the dress with like the multiple. We're, we're like kind of matching. The like nightgown dress with like the multiple ruffles. Oh my god this is so cute. And cute in like the creepy cute best way. And then an anatomically correct heart. I love these. I'm always terrible at drawing them, so I'm always very impressed when other people do them very nicely. This is so good. And then there's some stickers. These are so good. Okay, yes. So this is the one with, okay, no. Let's start with the smaller ones and then we'll go to the ones with the coupon codes. Classic little tombstone. Love it. A strawberry razor blade. At first I was gonna say strawberry switchblade, but it's a strawberry razor blade, which is like, could you imagine if they had like a sister band called that? Oh, that's like such a cute design idea. I've never seen that. A strawberry spider, dude. These are like very cool and creative ideas. I really, really enjoy this. And it's like on a pastel pink background, so it like goes perfectly with the decor in here. Okay, and last but not least, this beautiful postcard sort of situation. I think it's a postcard. It might be a sticker. No, I think it's a postcard. Gorgeous. Also, I love the, I think they're called pinking shears. Incredible. With the lady like falling away from the skull. This art style is so like nostalgic for me and so beautiful and oh my god, so cool. So yes, it says, here's a coupon code to share with your followers. It's Radis30. That's so sweet. It's 30% off everything and doesn't expire. Jelly, you are so sweet. The website, I will link it below. It's artbyjelly.com. Y'all must check it out. Oh. Let me turn the brightness down again. Oh wait, no, there it goes. Incredible 
I love it. You are so incredibly sweet. I am so excited to put these on things. I can't choose a favorite because they're all so good, but this one is like really, this one is really standing out to me. This is so fun. It's gonna look so cool on stuff. And then this is cool because as far as I know, with the kind of scissors, these like won't fray and I'll just be able to like sew them right onto things without having to like make a little border or anything. You thought of everything. I love it. I am so excited for these. Um, please check out this person if you are also into these designs like I am. Oh, so cool. Okay, <clears throat> on to the next one. And this is a repeat sender. Dude, you have sent me stuff before and you were so sweet. I recognize this sticker, Knox. Ah! You are so cool. They are an incredible tattoo artist, really, really talented. And I remember they sent me like a bunch of really beautiful art um, in my last unboxing. And I can't believe you sent me stuff again. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. The packaging on this is adorable. Look at these little kitties. And there is the Instagram. Y'all need to check this out. The designs are incredible. Look at the little hula hooping cats. Ah, these are so cute. Little kitties drinking out of teacups. You guys have the cutest stationery, I swear to God. Okay, so let's start with the note. I never know if I can like read these out loud. Oh my goodness, okay. Knox sent me an incredible, sweet letter. Um, they said they sent me a keychain and some stickers, and one of the stickers is of one of their cats, and one of them's a Halloween sticker. Your cat Robin, a ginger boy. Dude, ginger boys are the best boys, I freaking love them. Um, he sounds like an incredible cutie, and I can't wait to see the stickers of him. Oh my goodness, Knox, you are too, too sweet. Okay, let us go through this. Oh my god, dude, your art is wild. You packed this so full, dude. What the heck? There's like loads and loads of stuff. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's a little feminist cat sticker. And I say that because it has like a little thing that says feminist. It's got this incredible gradient of colors in the background, all the gorgeous pastels. It says beautiful men. And I recently found out that my, not that recently, but I found out that my microwave is magnetic because only like the side of my fridge is magnetic but the whole microwave frame is so i feel like that would look really cute there this is so beautiful oh my god dude oh, i love this cat design so cute okay <clears throat> little kitty note card look at that so cute with the polka dots on the side this is incredible Look at this Halloween cat card. When you said Halloween card, I wasn't expecting it to have cats on it. Maybe I just misread that. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's like a sticker in here. There's a holographic eyeball sticker. That's really fun. I was gonna just take it out to like, look at the thing without the glare on it. I didn't expect it to have, okay, yeah. So it's not just the back of the card. There's a card that has a long black and a flat white. That's so funny because I work at a cafe and those are types of coffee, but they're also <laughs> the cat. <laughs> the cat like ploofed over. That's really cute. Okay, I love that. Oh, and the, the back, the little design of the cat at the top is really cute. Look at this. This is like that super nostalgic, like 80s, 90s, vintagey kind of cartoon style. Dude, I love this so much. This is so cute. They have all the different cats in costumes. They have like the pumpkin cat and the devil and the mushroom. <laughs> and there's a Medusa one and a duck and one getting his face painted with little bats. Oh my God, dude, this is too much. This is so cute. This needs like a front and center spot in the Halloween display, it's adorable. And then you sent me so many stickers. <sighs> this one says girl power. It has an adorable bunny on it. Dude, this is the cutest. I love this art style so much. I'm just like making sure that you can see it. I like turned the light down so that it would be easier. Oh, this box. So cool, dude. I'm so excited to show these to Cage because I know like when I showed him the, all the tattoo stuff before, he's like, wow, they're like a really cool artist. Um, very, very cool. I love the, I think it's a red panda. I'm like not super familiar, but it's like a little raccoon-y looking guy, but I'm, but I think these are technically red pandas. There's a patch with a really cute cat on it. Oh, that's so cool. I love the double eyes and the horns and the tiny moon. Oh, look at this kitty. That is so perfect. Dude, that is too much. That is so cute. Oh my goodness, all the little beans and the little blush and the little eyebrows. Wow, 
strawberry stickers with the eyeballs and holographic. Dude, that's so cool. And my heart, I didn't notice that until now. That's so fun. Oh, that's very, very cool. Whoa! You sent me a keychain of it. Dude, that's so pretty. That is so sick. Oh my gosh. Got like a, a strawberry theme going on today. I love it. And a little feminist cat sticker. This one's holographic, like straight up. Like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. I'm obsessed with this one. It's a little striped gray tabby with an orange pumpkin on his head. Dude, too much. Again, I will link Instagram, shop, anything I can find below because this is too cute. <gasps> this is your cat. This is the cute, this is too much. Look at that little black. Look at the little mouth. Dude, Robert or Robin? I need to reread this. Robin. And I hope your other cat is also doing well, because I just realized now again that you said you have to... Look! Look at Robin! An angel! <laughs> a pumpkin! Oh my god! Look at that! Look at that little strawberry cat! That's so cute! <laughs> That's so fun! Cage will totally get a kick out of this one when I show him. Oh my gosh! A tiny sticker of Rob! <laughs> that is perfect. That is everything. And this is so cute. Dude, these stickers are like very nice, high quality, like water resistant. There we go. Oh my God. Look at that, that is so beautiful. What the heck? Okay. And then a bunch more cute little kitty cards. Oh, these three all have little watering cans. Little kitties with watering cans. Little Tuxy kitty with a shake. That is so cute. Oh my God, little Tuxy with a shake. A little family of Tuxies. This one's a little kitty with an umbrella and a mouse, dude! Nox, that is too sweet. This is an incredibly, incredibly sweet surprise. I... my goodness. The art, the talent is too much. The cats are too cute. The Halloween cats are too delightful. Your note is so sweet. I... thank you so, so much. That is like... it means so much to me. I really, really appreciate that. Okay, let me put this all back in its package so I don't lose anything and then we'll move on to the next one. Okay, so this next one, I know who it's from. Um, they had mentioned that they were gonna send me something. Um, if you're watching B, hi, I hope school is going well. And, um, oh my God, you're too sweet. You did not have to. He's very cool. We like hung out this one time. We like met at this market, which is very fun. Dude, and they're, they're a crocheter and they made me this like really cool spiderweb crochet top. And this looks like another crochet piece. Okay, let me read the note first. Okay, so they're saying that they know how much I appreciate handmade stuff, which I do. Um, and when they saw this ghost doily pattern by Marsha Glasner, they had to make it for me. No, stop, this is too sweet. Um, they said that it was really, really, oh gosh. Oh man. Oh, B, you are so sweet. I am so sorry for your loss and it is incredibly sweet of you to um, have thought of me to like have made me a little gift and like to send this letter and and I'm really happy that um, hanging out was like special to you because it was really special to me too it was the first time I ever like hung out with anyone that I met through um, this platform so like yeah that was incredibly special to me also and I hope you're doing well um, and yeah I really it, it was a really wonderful time and uh, this letter means a lot to me thank you okay um, I am really excited to see this no, stop. I just saw a glimpse and it's so cute. No, this is gonna look so good. This is gonna look so good. Dude, look at this. I need to learn to crochet. This is the most beautiful thing. Hello, hello. That is, that is gorgeous. B, you are so talented. And pattern maker, Marsha, I will link them below. You are so talented also. This is so thoughtful. Oh my goodness, that is too sweet. Oh god, <laughs> I like to, I get to a point where I don't know what to say. Thank you so much, this is incredible. Ah, okay, let me package this up and we'll move up to the next one. <laughs> okay, next I have an incredibly adorable package with a really cute bunny on it. And a really cute little mochi guy on it, advising us not to bend, so we have not. And there's really cute little stickers, and there's a little grape that says you're grape. That's so cute! Oh, <laughs> okay. Also very nice washi tape. Let's get opening. Uh, this is from A from Canada. I don't, I never know if I can say the name, so I will wait until it potentially says 
and if not, I will stick with the first initial. Oh my goodness, a little packet of things. My lordy, okay. We've got a protective paper, thank you. Oh my goodness, a very gorgeous print. Okay, okay, very nice. Oh yes, we spoke before. Oh, hello, Alana. Okay, very cool. Oh, this is from June 2023. Oh my gosh, I forgot. You have the beautifulest handwriting in the world. It they said they're very happy that <laughs> everything um, uh, arrives safely and they're collecting raven, raven trinkets. That's so cool. Um, yes, I'm having a wonderful time. Oh, they said they're going to include some art they've collected from different artists as well as some of their own art. Oh my goodness, you are so sweet, Alana. Yep, yep, I completely understand about taking a break from art. I, yep, sometimes we have to do that. I'm glad that you're able to step back and um, that you're able to refresh and recharge and start off art when, when it's uh, meaningful again or maybe like start making a different kind of art if that's what, what happens. Um, but regardless, I'm so excited to see it. So um, thank you for your very sweet letter. Let's look through the art. You're, you're such a sweetheart. Okay, this... I didn't realize that it's this non-binary bean on it. <laughs> He's so cute. It's a little mushroom with the non-binary colors, the purple, black, yellow, and white, which, okay, I find it so hard to make those colors look good together, and yet we have done it. I literally, it looked so aesthetically pleasing that I didn't even like realize at first until I read it, and then I was like, oh duh, obviously. That's so beautiful. So beautiful. I love the shape of, th this is so cute. This is gonna look so good on the wall. <laughs> okay, I love that. Very cute. Okay. Oh my gosh, there's like another, oh, so many things you guys. Oh, you have very nice tape. I'm scared to ruin it. Can I slide things out? Stop! This is so cute! Oh, you guys know me too well! The Halloween cat! Okay, this is fantastic. This is from um, Natalie at Rosalinda, so I'll be able to link them somewhere. Hello? We have to do the thing again. Sorry for the light change. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, so we can see this information of the artist and the patreon it will also be linked below so please enjoy that look at that look at that and it came with the matching sticker this is so cute it's like a black cat with the biggest eyes ever standing in a pumpkin patch with a happy little scarecrow in the back and the sun said this is i want to live in this scene you know what i mean i want to befriend this kitty and and just like hang out in the pumpkin patch with the scarecrow and and all the pumpkin that looks so nice i love that very talented artist Thank you for sharing their work with me. Oh my gosh. These small prints are all little intention card things I made last year. Also, the last print is by Midnight Raven Studios. They make a lot of LGBTQ witchy items. That's so cool. Okay. Choose an image theme that you connect with. Keep the image as a symbol of your intention. Write your intention on the included page and seal within the envelope. Release your intention. Oh, a little spell basically for intentions. That is so wonderful. Ooh, oh my goodness. This is gorgeous. I'm empowered to pursue my desires with like space to write those desires and then this flaming heart. Very beautiful. I love the, the color coding with the envelopes too with like the red envelope that's the attention to detail. Very, very cool. Okay, and now let's look at the other one. My existence is profound and vital to all creation. I need to like write these out and put them on my wall. Oh. Sorry, I don't know where the, where the tearing up came from all of a sudden. But look, it's a bunny in the flower meadow. This reminds me of a Van Gogh piece. I don't know which one, I don't know the name, but there's a piece that has all these beautiful, okay, this reminds me so much of these two Vincent Van Gogh postcards. Do you see it? Is it just me? Specifically this one, but also the white flowers of the other one. That is gorgeous. That is beautiful. I love the bunny. Sorry, my camera died. I hope the cutoff of that wasn't too abrupt. Um, incredible. I love the bunny card. Also, I don't know if I like showed properly this card, but the computer graphic, this is so cool. This is also like a very nostalgic aesthetic. I like it a lot. Okay, and then lastly, they sent me these two really gorgeous, almost like canvas looking prints. Okay, this is stunning. This is incredible. This raven print. Let me take it out. Thank you for being quiet opal. Oh, sorry, I just like caught a glimpse of the other print. Let me show you without the glass or without the plastic so you can see without the glare. That is so gorgeous. Do you see what I mean about like the canvas texture that you can see? 
gorgeous. This is gonna look so pretty in my bedroom. I was just thinking about how I like really wanna redo the decor in my room, but I was like, I'm not sure what I should put up. Y'all have solved the problem for me because I could just put up all the beautiful art that I get sent. I feel so lucky. And again, it says thank you for being. Look at this. This is a really beautiful piece of skull art. Let me look at it closely. Yeah, you can totally see the canvas, like all the little like, oh, that's so beautiful. I love when you can really like see the texture of everything. That's gorgeous. I feel like these need to be framed. I know Cage has a lot of frames, so maybe I can commandeer one. These are incredibly beautiful. I love how the, the skull almost has like a seashell look to it, the way it's all like pearlescent and has like all these different like tones within it. That's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Oh, thank you so much, Alana. You are too, too sweet, and I am too, too lucky to have followers such as yourselves. Okay, let me box these things up. Box them up. Put them back in their package so nothing gets lost, and then move on to the next item of the day. Next. This, I feel <laughs> so bad, because in the time that it has taken me to do this, this person has sent me two separate packages. Kata. <laughs> You are too sweet for this world. I literally, like, okay, this person is incredible. They are amazing. Kata makes the most awesome Barbie, like, spooky Halloween content on the internet because I, as a person, I'm, I don't know if you know, but I'm mostly into, like, Monster High, a little bit of Be Goth, a little bit of Nobby Stars, but I've never been a Barbie person. Kata has absolutely changed that for me. They make really, really cool content, um, specifically their Halloween content this year I was, like, living for. Um, and they sent me two packages. Insanity. Um, you did not have to do that, and that is really incredibly, intensely overly sweet. Also, they have a tuxi named Walter. So, like, points in my book. Cat people, especially tuxedo cat people, like, I get you. I understand you. I see you. So they sent me, firstly, this incredibly cute box with a little Emily sticker. This is zoologist in here, dude! <sighs> Kid is super sweet. They have sent me zoologist perfumes before, which is so freaking cool of them. Um, cause I did a video about zoologist perfumes a while ago and I did like a lookbook kind of review of, of some of the scents. And the fact that they sent me more is like, that, that is too sweet. You are too cool. And I am very excited to see what is in here, especially with the really cute Emily sticker. Oh my gosh. Hi, Rabbit, here's a few more zoologist samples that I'm passing on to you. I think I tried almost all of them now, but so far, Chipmunk is my fave. It's such a good one. Chipmunk is so good. I bought a fall-sized bottle, and husband wears it too. Yes! Uh, love, I didn't know about zoologist until your video, so thank you. Dude, no, thank you. Are you joking me? You sent me the packaging of... That's so cute. It's such a good design. Okay. With these and other samples I passed on to you last fall, it'd be so cool if you did another review video. Yes. Yes. Happily. Happily must do. With companion outfits, of course. I mean, duh. Um, I love that video. You have such cr- Oh my god, Kata, you're so sweet. Your friend and doll falls in taxis. Look at Walter. Look at this handsome Walter. I'm gonna cry. This is so cute. Oh, Kata, I have to do a- oh, Also, prettiest cards ever. Um, yes. Oh, that's a sticker. You taped it. So cute. Okay. I love cat pictures. I need to like start like just a collection of like subscriber cat pictures so I can have like a little wall of all the kitties of <laughs> and dogs and iguanas and whatever else animals but I'm just like so partial to cats and it's so precious to see them. But Kata, you are too sweet. You did not have to do this and I am so excited to just do a freaking um another another update video about this. Okay. I'll probably like save the smelling and the all of that to like that video. But I am so excited. Oh, dude, these are so cool. Okay, T-Rex. I've been so curious about T-Rex, you guys. Okay, I, I just, like, want, like, a little sniff, but, like, we'll save, like, the, the big ideas until later. Oh, Snowy Owl. Look at that. So gorgeous. Oh, my goodness. Okay, we have thoughts. They're, like, starting. They're simmering. Cardinal, this one's new. Oh, dude. Very cool. The bird scents are very, very fun. Also, the... the Oh my gosh, I'm excited to show these to Cage too. Ah, oh, elephant, yes. Oh, I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'll, I might, may or may not cut this part out. Oh my cack, that's really interesting. Okay, I am so excited to do a video of these. This is gonna be so cool. Kata, you are too sweet. I am so excited to do this video. Thank you for providing the perfumes for it. You did not have to, that is so incredible. Video coming soon. I can't wait, this is gonna be so much fun. Oh my God, Kata, you're too sweet. That was package one 
And then package two, again, lordy lordy. And this one, incredibly, incredibly cute Halloween-y stickers all over it. And it says pumpkins and zoologist on the outside. You know me so well. I, I don't know what I did to like deserve such sweet and kind subscribers like yourselves. Listen, these kitty stickers, where do y'all get them? They're so cute. It is too much for this world. Let's see. <laughs> these are so cute already. The stickers are incredible. I need to like save this to put on something else. Look at this happy haunting mischievous kid with the tiger outfit or just a stripey outfit. I don't know. Either way, incredible. Put that there for now. Yeah! I don't know if this is actually Scooby-Doo or if it just like has that Scooby-Doo art style, but it feels very much that to me and it makes me very, very happy. Look at that. So cute. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh! You have a Scalia sticker? What the heck? Okay, firstly, the zoologist wrapping paper. That is so cool. That is so freaking cool. I feel like I could do something very cool, like collage with this. I know there's like some interesting, like transfer kind of things you can do with um, this kind of paper. So like, I will have to look into that. Thank you for this. Cause this is like very cool crafting potential. And the Scalita sticker, that is so cool. Oh, monster high, monster high besties. Winchester Mystery House! Dude, I heard, I've i heard about this. I have never been. I wanted to go ever since I like um, read a thing about this. R okay, so they sent me a little postcard from it. Rabbit wishing you an eerie, spooky, hair-raising, spellbounding Halloween. Thank you. Love your fan and friend, Kata. Kata, you are so sweet. This is incredible. This is so freaking sweet. I also like, the design is very cool. It's very Haunted Mansion, which I saw for the first time this year. And I have to say, I did enjoy very, very much. I adore this English artist, Kaylee Radcliffe, who hand makes these vintage style ornaments. I thought you'd appreciate them too. Oh my God, this is incredible. First one, very, very cute. Little decorations on every single card. Like this is too much. You guys are so thoughtful. Oh, Kata, this is gorgeous. Why, why does this make me tear up? What is happening? Like, I don't know what is the emotions today, but it is too much. Look at this. The cat and the owl dancing. The owl and the pussycat in their dancing splendor. Oh yes, Kaylee Radcliffe. I will also link this artist below, because that is incredible. And Kate's YouTube channel, and that specific Halloween doll video that I'm referring to, because y'all, if you like my doll content, you will love that. Okay, these are, incredible. I have not seen this kind of thing in person ever. Like I've seen like some people kind of do like collage art kind of things of this, but I've never seen like actual in person. Let me see. This is like, yeah, this is like the info. Oh, a very cute little hedgehog, but also just like the information if anyone is interested. Also will be linked below, of course. And little hedgehog just to show you because it's adorable. These are incredible. Oh my goodness. Oh my, oh my god, the, okay, like, I can't decide which one I like best because each one is better than the next. First, this, like, gorgeous, elegant, like, kind of almost clown moon. Like, this outfit is very gorgeous. The, the ruffles definitely remind me, like, a little bit of, like, a clown outfit, but, like, in the best way, like, the most gorgeous, elegant circus, and, like, the silver string. These are incredible. Clement, that's their name. Okay, hello Clement. Welcome. Welcome to the world. You will look incredible in the Halloween display. That is incredible. Oh my goodness. Okay, Clement, I love you. Next, what's this one's name? Peter. Peter, I love you, Peter. Dude, Cage is also gonna get such a kick out of these. These are incredible. Look at that face. Look at the the details on this. These are stunning. Um <laughs> this is so cute. This kitty, but it also kind of reminds me of Krampus. <laughs> There's like a little uh, mousy in there. Oh, this is so good. Little devil cat. This is so tuna in the best way possible. This is incredible. I, I love that. It's so fun. Oh, wow. I did not know about this artist, so thank you for introducing them to me. Okay. Oh my goodness. You sent me so many things. Oh my gosh, Demeter, you're my fragrance influencer. I'd love to try everything and if they don't work for me, I'm happy to pass them on. Feel free to do the same. Oh my goodness, Kata, golden delicious. Oh, an apple. I love apple smells. 
And this one is so fresh and nice and I freaking love Demeter. They're like such a cool and interesting brand. I really, really like that. I like might do like a little companion piece of the of the things for Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Transfixed. Dark Roses. Oh, this is the Dark Flowers collection. Vampire Blooms and Witching Hour. Dude. I am so excited about that. These are really, really fun. I'm very, very excited. More zoologist for you. Hubs and I are now devoted to chipmunk and camel. I have heard good things about camel. He also loves harvest nuts, and I'm debating on chameleon. Ooh. So these will also be included in the video, of course. Bat. I love bat. I love to have another bat. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Cockatiel. Okay, I haven't smelled cockatiel before. Yes. Yes, I like that very much. Yes, patchouli and vanilla, that is why I like that very much. Champagne, raspberry, rhubarb, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Tiger, ooh. That's exciting. And Dodo, oh, this one's like, very interesting packaging on this one. It's like one of the very few colorful packagings. Ooh, that is very, very fun. Okay, I'm excited to add those to the video as well. And then these are, oh, this is very interesting packaging. A friend went to Florence and visited this old monastery perfumery that's been making sense since 1221. Here's one of their most famous fragrances. Tobacco Toscano. Ooh. Oh, and then there's a liquid soap and a bath gel of the same thing with like very interesting, um, I know they're not. They remind me of blood bags <laughs> in the best way because like spooky stuff is the best. But these are so fun. Dude, what the heck? That is so cool and just like historic like what? I you're too sweet Kata I am so excited to make a little video featuring all of these I will be sure to link you because this is like you are too sweet this is too much oh my goodness okay I also love that like getting into perfume per, getting into perfumes is so fun I freaking love scents and smells and all the like it's such an evocative sense for me, the way that like smelling different things can like really bring you back to a specific moment or a specific fantasy or just like a memory or an element. Like it's it's incredible. So thank you for all of this. I am so excited to do a little a little review perfume uh, perfume video tour. I think I know what my, my what my next video might be now. Oh oh my god, there's more. Oh my god, Kata. Oh, these are so cool. Little spiderweb coasters or patch felt clothing except whatever I want to do with them. I got little felt spider things. These are very, very cool. I know they're probably supposed to be coasters, but I feel like these have very cool patch potential as well. I love him or her or them. This is an incredible little kitty, <laughs> little kitty with the guitar. This feels so 70s. I love it. Oh, fantastic. This will look really, really cute in the Halloween display. Oh my God, Kata, that is too much. You are too sweet. Thank you. Holy cow. Um, I'm also really happy you like chipmunk and, and camel. I, I need to try camel. Um, thank you for everything. That is incredibly sweet. Let me pack this this up and, and video coming soon and, and we'll do and we'll do um, the, the things. Okay, next package, one second. Okay, the next package is also from someone who sent me stuff before and also a fellow creator on YouTube. Um, this is from Catherine. Catherine makes really, really incredible, like proper vintage and antique kind of content. For me, I find the antique and vintage world kind of intimidating, but Catherine makes it super, super accessible and beautiful. She does these really cool live streams. Um, one of my favorite things about her is, is like the incredible like vintage jewelry that she often features in videos. So that's really, really fun as like a little like kind of fashion interested person. Uh, but yeah, just in general, really, really cool vintage spooky items. If you're into estate sales and like purchasing secondhand items, I think that's your person. You gotta check them out. Uh, and if you're interested in just like watching the fun stuff and like getting a little peek in the antique world like me, then their YouTube channel is fantastic. But yes, they've sent me a very large envelope. So let's see what's in here. And I feel incredibly bad because I know they mentioned that they wanted this to arrive before Halloween. And I am the worst for making these kind of videos. I meant to do this, I meant to do like an unboxing during Vlogoween, but I'm just pretending this is an extension of Vlogoween. So let's pretend that that's a thing. Let's see what's in here. Okay, we got like some paper packaging. I am seeing some vintage jack-o'-lantern print. And it is piquing my interest very much. Oh, stop. Okay, first, there's some very cute stickers. 
There's some very cute stickers and an envelope with my name on it. So let's give that a little read. That was almost letter opener smooth. Ooh. Oh, look at that. It's a little 3D card with a ghosty on it. This is boo. Oh my goodness. Okay. Happy Halloween. Rabbit, I saw these signs and I think I remember you saying you were looking for the bat one. I hope they bring you joy. Thank you for all the work and creativity you put out into the world. It means so much. Fellow spooky season lover Catherine Young. Catherine? Catherine, I am so excited. And also like, you shouldn't have. Okay, firstly, a bunch of stickers that I have to show you. Okay, this is so incredibly beautiful and detailed. Got a little like tarot card, little tarot card spread. This one with this spooky cute little black cat. I love that. Oh, this one's so cool. Like Halloween postcard looking thing. But like a little mini version. This would look so cute in like a little dollhouse as like a little Halloween poster for them. That would be amazing. Oh, another one of those like, oh, that's very cool. Little like kind of vintagey spooky witch with like the cauldron and the little witch outfit. Look at that. The little pumpkin and the black cat and the little broom or mop or, uh, oh, candle. Ha! <laughs> I'm dumb. <laughs> look at that. I got too excited about the Halloween imagery to look properly. That's so cute. <sighs> Ooh, Alphonse Mucha, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but an incredible artist. Very, very inspirational. One of my dad's favorites, I think. That's really cool. Um, words are escaping me. Bull? Cow? Large horned animal skull. <laughs> Maybe a bison or a buffalo? Regardless, gorgeous. Love the um, muted tones in the background. This is really nice. And it has almost like a string of pearls looking plant in the background, which is one of my favorite plants. It's like a stack of books with crystals and a plant in the background. Cool! This is just like a little um, paper tag with like a little vintagey man on it. And some horses. Very cool. Cat blood dried and powdered. <gasps> love that little sticker. Oh, that's so cute. I love the like very adorable like vintage like 70s, 80s kind of Halloween style. That's fantastic. Oh, this is so cute. I think this is like some some game of some sort, but the owl is incredible. And then, yeah, it's just, like I love like weird little things that you're like, I don't know what this is from, but the, you know, I, I love to save like little cool scraps like this. So fun. And this crystal. Okay, and now these are gorgeous. Whoa, they're different. Okay, sorry. I first I thought they were the same. Is it just like an incredibly gorgeous piece of beautiful paper? The scrapbooking possibilities. Oh, whoa, oh no, it's huge, huge. The possibilities, endless. This is gorgeous. The designs are so good. So cute. The pumpkin ones are so good too. Incredible, and I'm guessing it's like the same size. That's so freaking cool. I love the like, very like kind of brown paper. The texture is like really nice too. Catherine, you should not have. This is so, what, what is happening? No, you're joking. This, yes, these, the bad signs. Oh my God. Okay, these freaking things. I was looking for these and I could not find them. Okay, Jade the Leader. <laughs> Uh, yes, <laughs> I am so pleased about this. Okay, Jade the Libra did a video about these where I think it was like a, oh, it might have been Dollar Tree that they did uh, these really cool Halloween signs with like the, the this almost like circusy look to me. I don't know if that's what they were going for, but for me it's like circus. Um, it says beware haunted. The back is so cool. Dude, this is gonna look so cool on the wall. And they included a bonus when this says trick or treat, Catherine. You did not have to. I was looking for this bat sign and I did not find it at the end of the season and I'm so happy I have it now. Ah, thank you. You are so freaking sweet. And these little like vintage things are so cute and the card is so cute and the stickers are so cute and just fantastic. I love that. Thank you so much. That is really, really cool. I was like, what bat signs did I say I was looking for? Yes, I did say I was looking for those. You guys are the best. Okay. Thank you, Catherine. I hope you're doing well. I also hope your cat's doing well. I know you posted a picture of him on Thanksgiving. Him or her? I think it's a him. There was a Thanksgiving picture where I think you called him a chunky turkey and it was like the cutest pictures I had ever seen of a cat. Like, oh, precious brown tabby. I love it. Okay, I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you again. This is so thoughtful. Okay. Okay. Next, I have this square parcel that is from, I will just say the initials S-Y, and I wanna say from Ontario, but I can't tell. Um, O-N, that might be Ontario, that might be somewhere in the States. 
Who knows? Canada Post. No, that must be Ontario, right? And I promise we're almost done. This is the second to last one. Thank you guys for sticking with me. I know this is probably a long video because I tend to take forever to go through things. Whoa! Oh my god! It's like a party! <laughs> oh, this is so cute. Sorry, I just have to show you guys. Hopefully things aren't gonna fall out. There's like really cute little, um, god I don't remember what these characters are called, but they're like little cute anime, like animal kind of co looking characters, and there's like fairy sparkle stuff, and little packing peanuts that are shaped like hearts. I have not seen such cuteness. I didn't know they made packing peanuts that were heart shaped and pastel colored. I need to find a jar just to put these in because they're so cute and like I know that you should just throw out packing peanuts but why would you when they're so cute okay hi rabbit I'm actually the person who replied to the comment I in one of your videos I just wanted to send you some things I thought you could use in your crafts no stop I've been watching your videos for a while hello fellow Canadian hello fellow Canadian <laughs> and I felt really safe to be who I am through watching you just be who you wanted to be in your everyday life that it helped me gain some confidence of my own oh my god okay Oh, they work in a corporate job. Yep, that sucks. Uh, they also have low self-esteem. Listen, me too, dude. I mean, it, it might not like come off that way all the time, but I do and I relate. Overthinking about what other people think of me? Yes. Ah, uh, yes, I relate to also loving anime and manga fashion. Yes, life is too short to put yourself in a box and decide what you can and can't wear based on like what other people say. Yay, and then you're into J fashion. Oh. Oh my gosh, this is so incredibly sweet and gen like generous of you to send me incredible craft supplies and so sweet of you to like open up and talk about these things because I also relate very hard to like the the anxieties about like dressing how you want and like being who you are and like it's easier on the internet sometimes than it can be in real life and I can't imagine working a corporate job and having to like tamp that down so like having people tell me that like just my little corner of the internet like means something to them means so much and the fact that you like thought of me enough to like send ca that's so cool you are so cool dude i hope you're doing well this is so cute okay first of all hi i love this it's like black sparkly mesh with bats and spider webs and spider dude wait i think it's a is it like a curtain it might just be a piece of fabric but it's like hemmed in a way that makes me think it's like originally some it has probably I don't know it might just be a sheet or like a cloth a tablecloth regardless incredible fabric I just thought it was like a swatch of the fabric but it's like hemmed and everything um uh, look at that that could make a really cool top it's very nice and stretchy it could make really cool gloves it could make I don't know whatever it's gonna make it's gonna make a very cool one thank you this is very thoughtful and then this what the heck huh Halloween washi tape Dude, this is so cute. Look at that. This is so cute. <laughs> it has all like the blacks and the purples and the greens. Oh my god, I love that. Okay, I freaking love hair accessories. Dude, these are so good. Oh my god, you sent me three different sets of- Dude, these are so cute. Hello. Okay, little ghosty bows with a spider web. These are so precious. Dude, I'm gonna do such cute looks with these. Okay, these ones. Ah! Oh my god, it's a little pumpkin, and he's wearing a little pumpkin on his little hat. Pumpkinception, double pumpkin. I love it, and the bows are orange and black on that one. And then there's little purple and black witch bows, witch hat bows. These, oh my god, dude, these are so fun. I have like some very interesting like Halloween video ideas next year that I honestly like want to start filming now and just have them queued up for October, but these accessories will be very, very helpful for those. Thank you. Okay, still can't get over the adorable packing peanut. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god, things are like falling out. You sent me so much. Holy, okay. This is so fun. It's like a little triplet skull. <laughs> it's like heavy too. This is so cool. Oh, I really like that. I'm gonna live there for now. And this also fell out. This is so fun. This is like so nostalgic feeling. It's like a black cat uh, necklace or bracelet or other such beaded accessory. Oh no, it says Halloween necklace. Oh, it's like nice and um, flexible too. This is so fun. Look at that. Oh, does that not scream like 80s Halloween nostalgia? This is so cute. These are amazing. Dude, did you send me fabric? Like more fabric? Okay, very cool. Napkins, the haunted house and the ghosties. Mini multi cloth. This is very cute. It's little pumpkin. Oh, can you see it? It's like a little pumpkin 
doily. Oh, I'm gonna have the cutest doilies ever for Halloween next year. All my tables will be precious with ghosts and pumpkins and all such things. This is so fun. Oh, okay, it's a Halloween bandana. <laughs> this is so fun. Oh, you guys know me so well. Me and my beloved Halloween. I was like sad that Halloween was over, but it's it's true. It never ends, especially not in my heart and especially not when I have like amazing people like you that will keep the magic going for me. This is so, you guys did not have to. Spooky, may the magic of Halloween be with you. Indeed, and with you. These are placemats. That is so cool. That is so fun. I thought it was just like fabric, but that is so fun. I love this kitty specifically very, very much. Mischief face to the max. These are so fun. I'm gonna have some very cute times with these. Oh, dude, you are too sweet. Thank you so much. I love the Halloween stuff. It's very thoughtful of you to think of me. And thank you also for your very heartfelt note because um, sometimes I'm like, I'm just doing this and no, like it's just, you know, out into the ether. But then sometimes I'll get messages like this or comments like this or, you know, just people saying really incredible stuff. And it's very touching. And I just want you to know that like the community that you have built as people that like watch me and stuff and the way you're like kind to each other and to me in the comments the way that like you interact and are just like always so like sweet and respectful it, it means the world to me and it's such a safe place for me too and like little me would have loved and longed for this kind of community and the fact that I like get to have it now um just I I am so lucky every day and it's it's so cool so thank you thank you thank you thank you <laughs> last but not least we have something from LK from TN. Tennessee, Tennessee. All right, LK. And they sent me a very cool recycled packaging box. GoScribbler.com. Sure, why not? Okay. Whoa, okay. Wishing you happiness and healing. Oh, thank you. Oh, dude, this is such cool packaging. Okay, let me just like put my sticky note over this so you don't have to see the address and then you can look at this this is so cute look at the little ghost you look at the little kitty look at the little this is where do you guys get the cutest packaging in the world i swear to god the scariest thing is the sheer number of stamps tbh <laughs> yes <laughs> okay um i think the note might be in here if there is one so let me open this first also very cool heavy duty packing tape I see a very cool box, but I will read the letter first. Whoa! Y'all have the coolest stickers. Don't forget to sparkle! No, I love the Cordy sticker. Don't you dare apologize for the Cordy sticker. I'm obsessed. Also, this is a really, really fun. I like that a lot. Oh, this is so cute. Oh. I didn't realize, sorry, I didn't notice the little kitty tape until now. And it's awesome. That is so cool. Okay. I am ready to read my letter. Whoa! You guys send me the prettiest cards in the world, I swear to God. Okay, firstly, ha, it's like a little ghosty, ghosty paper. <laughs> That's so fun. Okay, oh, this is so cool. Look at this. That is so fun. A pocket on a card. Ingenious. I love interactive things like that. That's so cool. Okay, so it's a little ghosty. And you just like made him out of... I love recycling like this, that is so cool. Oh, so cool. Okay, does this open? Just a friendly wish to say have a happy pumpkin day. Oh, this is the best. I love this kind of collage art, I wanna call it. I've been watching a lot of Halloween Happy who makes this incredible like scrapbooking YouTube content and this really reminds me of that aesthetic. It's one that I seek to emulate and I adore it and um, it's so cool. I love the recycled thing. Oh my god, I'm done. You can flip it up to read it. And to, oh my gosh, oh my goodness, okay. Oh, you have the prettiest handwriting and it like goes all out into three things. Okay. Hi Rabbit, my name is Shang and I am so glad that I found your channel last summer. I watched probably your entire backlog and just, oh, I'm so happy that I was able to keep you company. Oh, especially another non-binary punk goth type like me. Represent. So I thought I could give you back in some way. Uh, along with the little goodies, I felt I could offer my talent as a reader. Oh, my family is mixed Chinese and Romani. Cool. 
not Romanian. Okay, so they're Romani and they do fortune telling as a family trade. That goes back all the way to back to when we left India in the millennium age. So pretend we're doing this on the autumnal equinox because this is the harvest thread, a little one, but I got the start of October. This is incredible. And they did like stamps of the cards. Okay, one, the heart. Okay, they gave me a tarot reading. This is incredible. Oh, oh. Wow, okay, this tarot reading. That is incredibly special that you would share this gift with me. I will treasure this. This is, I mean, I obviously treasure all of the things that you guys send me and I keep them all in a really, really special box and sorry, I didn't realize the beauty of these cards and that also. Also, who has tarot stamps? That is so cool. And the fact that you used orange ink, incredible. This tarot reading, I will treasure it. I will read it again before bed because I feel like I'm just, like all my emotions are running really high right now so I can't like quite absorb everything yet. But this is striking me very hard. And um, yeah, if anyone's curious about my tarot reading, I will tell you that I got the harvest, the offering, the scythe, and the wheel of death. And it is incredibly special to me that you would like share your talents with me and this like familial tradition. I feel so special to be a part of it. Sorry. The emotions are too much for me today, and I don't know where it's coming from, but I really appreciate it. Okay, thank you for your beautiful card. Now I will look at the rest of your incredible art that you have sent me. This is so cute! It's a little kitty box. And it's orange on the outside with black and white kitties on the top. Can I open it? That is the question. These are so cute! These are magnets! Okay, let me turn down the thing so you can see it. They're bottle cap magnets and they look hand painted. Dude, if you made these, these are incredible. I hope you included like an Etsy shop or something so I can link these. It says, boo, I love you. This one says, hello, pumpkin. And it's got a little happy pumpkin. Oh my goodness. I, I need to see if I have some like magnets in my collection because these I want to wear as pins. So I'm going to see if I have some magnets so I can just like attach them to my clothes because I want to wear these. These are so good. This one says spider. Oh, very cool with the spider web. I love these colors that you chose as well. This one says I love me and it has one of the cutest kitties I've ever seen. Look at that. That's so good. Okay. And last but not least, candy corns, my beloved. I am so sad that I cannot eat candy corns as a vegan, but I love them aesthetically, so I always appreciate art of them. This is like the cutest little packaging box, and like the ridges are all painted as well. I'll turn the light back on in a sec. What, what a delightful little package. That is absolutely incredible. Thank you. You are very talented with art. And it says happy Halloween on the inside. Thank you, happy Halloween also. <laughs> okay, and then lastly, there's this. Whoa, this feels heavy. Whoa. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. Is that painted? It's like this incredible glass flower art with a butterfly in it. That is gorgeous. I have never seen like someone just paint the butterfly on. That is so beautiful. I'm so happy that it arrived safely. You packaged it very well with the everything. Wow. You are incredibly sweet. Thank you for your tarot reading, for your pins, for your frame with the, I, I want to call this like your butterfly art. Thank you for your butterfly art and everything else. That is so, so sweet. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, my heart is very, very full right now. Oh goodness. Okay. That was like overwhelming in the best way possible. I want to say thank you so, so much for watching the video. Thank you to everyone who sent me things. Um, please, if you watch this video, do not feel pressured ever to send anything or, or anything like that. You watching is more than enough and this is incredibly touching and sweet and thoughtful. And I am so thankful for, for um, such incredible viewers and a community like yourselves. I, I really am excited to link everyone below and hopefully um, people with like Etsy's and stuff can get even more traction to it and people with YouTube channel can get more viewers because I just want to like spread the love. I am speechless, I have no words, this is so sweet. <laughs> you guys are too good to me. Thank you again for watching this video. Um, thank you to all who have sent things. I apologize 3000% again. I am so sorry that it takes me 20 years to open things. I don't know what that is about me. I need to work on it. But my PO box will always be linked in the description of my videos if anyone's ever interested in that. Thank you. Sorry. 
you guys are the best, I love you, and I, I, I don't know what else to say. Thank you so much for watching. I'll sign off now and leave you to have a great rest of your day. Thanks again. Have a good one, and um, <laughs> love you. Bye.